Hello, don't you see the merits were in darkness at the Alderney landing when I was younger and free. To see no merits must be nice. Jackie Torrance did it twice, but I hosted in Dartmouth four or five times. I can't remember. I can barely rhyme anymore. It's been a while. The last time was back in Art 10 when a young, sprightly George Pothetos was just finishing his first season at Neptune Theater. Ah, 2010, a misty watercolored memory. <laughs> so much has changed, so much has stayed the same. A few more of us were married, a few less of us had children. <laughs> yep, times sure have changed. But some things are the same. You know, Two Planks and a Passion is still hiring the same four geniuses to swoop in, win their merits, and fly back to their pewter castles in the sky. There's a lot of companies this year. I went through it, there's an awful lot of companies. There's Low Hi-Fi and Villains, which used to be like something like Ville Poisson. I think it means fish violin or something. They got the system licks. Just keep changing your name so you can emerge and re-emerge each year. If you have too much to drink tonight, don't wake up tomorrow morning with a new theater company, because what's your fundraising model going to be? A gun and a dollar sign bag? Marty. Yes, voice of goddess? Just try and have a fun night, all right? Thank you, voice of goddess. I will. We have an exciting night tonight, folks. There's magic and merits in the air, so let's give out a few dozen pewter door stoppers. Lighting design, outstanding lighting design. Um, I'd almost swear under these lights that my white and gold suit looked blue. <laughs> and the first merit of the night goes to Leanne Verdi, The 39 Steps, Neptune Theater. I am clearly not Leanne, but she did have the courtesy of sending a nice little pre-prepared speech. The tech rehearsals were amazing because we were all working so hard to get the precision the show needs. And then I would look up from my monitors and see Christian standing there in his hysterical beard and kilt or Reese in his spectacular cleavage. It's a miracle the show had any lights at all. I was laughing so much. Thanks again. And now, to present the award for costume design, sponsored by Dalhousie University, please give an enthusiastic applause to the fellow who will present the award, the one, the only, Garrett Barker! It's been said, don't dress for the job you have. <laughs> dress for the job you want. And the Merit Award for Best Costume Design goes to Jennifer Goodman for The Tempest. Thank you. Uh, clearly, I am not Jennifer Goodman. Uh, Jennifer couldn't be here this evening, but she wanted me uh, to thank especially the entire company of The Tempest for being very patient with her in what she describes as a very organic experience. <clears throat> for those of you who are there, you'll understand what that means. That's a kind way of putting it. And the merit goes to the story of a sinking man, Kick of the Dark Theatre Company. He looked out over the crowd. Oh God. They were all looking at him. Should he try to say something profound? Would they get that he was doing a bit in the style of the show? <laughs> they might. Trust your audience. Was he being pretentious? Probably. 